Hello, uh, welcome to building Statomic sites quickly and efficiently. I am Jack McDade. Uh, I am the creator or founder or whatever you want to call it of Statomic. Um, Statomic has been around for four and a half years now, which is crazy to even say, but this is our first paid course. I felt like it was way, way, way overdue. There's a lot of stuff I'd love to teach you, and it's really hard to cram it all into the doc, sometimes just taking a couple hours uh, out of your out of your time to watch something happen beginning to end is the best way to learn something. And so with this course, I hope to be able to do that for you and to help you step up your game to build sites quicker, more efficiently, obviously, as the title says, uh, but also teach you some tricks, uh, maybe some uh, shortcuts and commands and how to kind of kickstart uh, and bootstrap new static sites faster. You can see my process, the way we build sites at Statomic and uh, love to hear back from you and learn your tricks as well, incorporate them into future classes and, and uh, modules, but uh, here we go. In this overview, I'm gonna show you what we're gonna build. Uh, we're gonna build a, a website, a real website actually. I always feel like fake websites kind of feel fake, like you're learning fake content. So uh, I redesigned my buddy's site. He's a chimney sweep and he owns a company called Saratoga. Chimney Sweep. Uh, they're here in upstate New York. He has a couple of trucks on the road, and if you have a word a wood burning fireplace, you need to have it sweeped and, uh, and at least inspected every single year. You think chimney sweeps are dead or something from Mary Poppins, but no, they're real and they wear top hats. It's kind of awesome. So what we're gonna build is what is effectively a pretty common website, nothing overly complicated, but thorough. So we've got a home page with a lot of different kind of content modules or blocks, right? We've got the hero with the call to action. Uh, we've got, you know, your navigation with uh, some global information like phone number, email address, that kind of stuff. We've got some text blocks. We've got a video caption. We have a block quote, uh, more content, assets, images, Secondary calls to action down here. We've got a map. Uh, we've got a footer and other stuff down here. So this is a pretty common looking site. Uh, honestly, it looks really good compared to a lot of the competition, if I say so myself. And uh, we'll get into some of the subsections later, like contact form, uh, homeowner's guide, which would probably be a collection full of helpful information like FAQs, that kind of stuff about us. There'll be some photos and some more content. And so this should be a pretty good cross-section of the features that you'll use while building Statomic. Uh, we'll start with Statomic 2.2. Uh, it's a pre-release right now as I'm recording this. Uh, it is really close to release and I don't think you'll notice anything different in this particular build. If so, I'll make sure I come back and update the course for you so that it is as, as accurate as possible. Um, so with that said, uh, we're gonna end this little intro and we'll get started with uh, the base install in the next segment. 